A boxing class in Merle's Inlet is bringing hope to people with Parkinson's disease. Rocksteady Boxing of the 843 holds classes at American Fitness. WMBF News anchor Patrick Lloyd and photojournalist George Hansen show us how Parkinson's patients are fighting back against the disease. In tonight's This is Carolina. These will be yours. We're going to do some dumbbell warm up today. And then the bag, speed bag, blaze pause, normal routine. Working out. It's something people do for a variety of reasons. Two more. Training for competitions. Working Six. to lose weight. We're breathing and we're balanced. Seven. Or just becoming healthier versions Three. of themselves. Good job. But Two. for the people participating in the rock steady boxing class at American Fitness in Merle's Inlet, their workouts are meant to combat an invisible opponent inside them. Each participant has Parkinson's disease. It's designed for patients specifically diagnosed with Parkinson's because it intertwines the benefits of boxing with Parkinson's disease and uh, slowing the progression. Let's step in, close the distance. Colby Utt the owns American Fitness. Hands, he teaches this class point. twice a week. As soon as you punch, you bring those hands right back to your face. And I've actually seen a lot of improvements in strength, coordination, and balance. So we're trying to uh, improve, but if nothing else, we're trying to slow the progression of the disease. Somebody early on had said, just don't think about it, but it's, there's always something to remind you that it's there. Marjorie Baker, better known as Marge, was diagnosed with Parkinson's four years ago. She says taking care of her body while living with this relentless affliction is a balancing act. If you do too much, you get very, your muscles get very tight. If you don't do enough, your muscles get very tight. Marge admits the workouts are tough and often not the most enjoyable, but she notices a difference in her body when she goes to the classes compared to when she doesn't. With COVID, I couldn't go anywhere and, and I really felt that I fell behind a little bit there. So it's, it's really good to, to be here and to do other things than just to keep going. And red, Marge Green. The class also incorporates these circular lights that change colors. One participant has to touch them when they turn red, the other when they turn green. What we're trying to do is stimulate the brain by reacting to the colors and the patterns of the pods. It's been really effective uh, for our patients with Parkinson's disease, and it's been really effective with helping their reaction time. One, two. A quality workout for both the brain and the body for those looking to knock out Parkinson's. If you or someone you know has Parkinson's and would like to start taking these classes, you can find out how to do so on our website, wmbfnews.com. And if you have a good news story you'd like us to share, send us an email at goodnews at wmbfnews.com or send me a message on Facebook.